Alrighty, hello everybody. My name is Sam, and you're back here for another episode of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I could really go so, for some food right about we now. We really did the tutorial to begin with, so let's see if we can try to get to through the Sand Saga. What's up? Let's take a look here. Oh, he doesn't even re I can't tell at all the strength I've gained in the way, so I'm planning on getting back into serious routine. All right. So what are you saying is you want to fight me? Huh? You? Uh, maybe some other time. <laughs> I'm going to focus on some mental simulation training first. Mental simulation training? Oh, you mean where you do it in your head. You should try it sometime when you get a chance. All right, I got a D-metal <laughs> Guess you could call it a training keepsake. Okay. Yeah. That's a great thing about mental uh, simulation training is you can do it whenever, uh, wherever you want. <laughs> like the beach, for All example. Right, here we go. All right, I want to give it a try. I mean, we were doing this before. All right, so we got the training rounds. All right, let's see. Can we move on or do we have to do the training? We got to do the training. Okay. What's this first? Oh, this is when... Uh... All right, we got a present from Master Roshi. That's one. Goku gave him the Dragon Ball. All right, we're gonna verse Krillin and try to learn the consecutive. Oops, I hit no by accident. All right, mental training. And... Uh -oh. I gotta remember how to fly. Step dodging to attack, close range, press X. All right, I'm really late now. Uh, I hit him once and that was it. There we go, here we go. There we go, that's a solid hit right there. Don't remember how to get over there. Guarding L2. First, press square while guard. Ah, oh, okay. That's an advantage. My power! Oh shit, he stunned me. Come on, baby, let's get him. No, just not. Oh, we don't have a beam struggle. Alright, I haven't seen this yet. Come on, Kermit, what do you got? What do you got? That was just good timing. Ooh, got him nice and good there. Ooh, got a trophy too. Newfound power. Nice. We got consecutive energy blast. Boom. All right. This should be enough training for now. Maybe I'll talk with the guys for just a bit longer. So he's got your looks, but, but does he, he have your power too? I'm betting that he's pretty strong if I had to guess. I can't be sure since Chi Chi won't let me train him to find out one way or the other. Yeah, I want to continue the story. Come on, let's get Raditz in here. Hey, Dad, what was that? Hmm, not sure. All right. Well, I guess we're getting ready for Raditz here. So let's see what Raditz can do to us. Come on, baby. Let's get in there. Let's get to Raditz. Let's get him to kidnap Gohan so we can beat him up and then have Gohan beat him up. I'm still waiting. I don't know why it's taking so long to load. Come on, baby. Let's load. Mm -hmm. 
What is it? It ain't no meteor! Just as I thought, the creatures on this planet are still alive. Kakarot's failed us. Uh, who or what are you? A power level of only five? What trash. Uh, stay back! Ah! Is this the best this planet can muster? Well, now, here's a large power reading. Distance 4880. Kakarot? Huh, what in the world could that have been? I've never felt a power like this. Oh, it's Piccolo time. Uh, press L3 to boost. All right, L1, field or mid flank. Tech nearby animals. Uh, while moving the field, press L1 to check the start. Okay. Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. It isn't Goku. Oh, this is training, isn't it? All right, that's training. But if it isn't him, then who is it? Got a D metal, okay. <laughs> Let's get these orbs too while we're at it. I know they like the orbs. Guess I'd better look for more. Well, now this could be fun. Oh, we got some enemies. Yeah, let's try fighting them with Piccolo. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. Oh, you just jump right in. There's no fight. There's no, uh, hold on. All right, cool. No loading screen. I will jump in and do fighting. Come on, Skull Robo. Is that all you had? All right, we got some 20 XP in there. Let's see if there's any more. could he be? Well now, this could be fun. Just oh, we got some more. Of you. Is this what you got, Skull Robo? What does he got? I didn't even look. Die! Consecutive energy. This is a super attack where you use the L stick during the attack to aim. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Finish off, Robot. You gotta learn how to use that But it's okay. We got the beat. Let's go. Let's move out. Let's move on out of here. This could be fun. All right, let's get to, let's get a move on here. Can't fight everyone right now. What's going on? I think we just bumped into Raditz. Chit. So it wasn't Kakarot after all. Who the hell are you? I don't have time to waste with you. Wait a minute. This is a Namekian, isn't it? What the hell is a Namekian doing on this planet? If that's true, then what are you even doing here? You got a death wish? <laughs> You've got spunk. I like that. Hmm. A power level of 322, huh? You're definitely stronger than the others. 
But you wouldn't even be a warm-up for me. You're making a mistake in underestimating me. Oh, we're about to fight some Raditz without Goku. Let's see if you can make this fun for me. Is it this guy? <laughs> I'm out of key. Charge up real No way, I'm sorry. Oh, I got my key. Nice, here we go. Come on, stop blocking the rats. There it is. There we go. Nice some hits in there. Got the follow. Whoa! Where'd that tough guy attitude go? You done already? What's going on? Come on, baby, get that follow up. That all, huh? <laughs> you finished. I mean, that all. I beat your ass. Bridge level two, though. That's good. That all, huh? Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. <clears throat> I'm getting another large power reading. That's got to be Kakarot. That face, that's not a pleasant looking face. Impossible. Who the hell is this guy? And where is he going? Well, I guess we're getting our looks at Raditz here. He took on Piccolo by himself for a bit. Now we're waiting to see if we can take him on with Goku and Piccolo. <laughs> well, if it isn't Kakarot, you've grown. You look just like our old man. What? Tell me, Kakarot, what is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time? Huh? Who are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You have got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine then, allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying! That can't be true! Long ago, you were sent to this pathetic planet to rid it of all life! We say and search the universe for habitable planets and wipe out all who live there so that we can sell those planets to the highest bidder. Weak, snot-nosed brats like you are sent to low-level planets like this. And fortunately, it looks like this one's got a moon. Uh, if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait, what about the moon? What does that have to do with anything? 
Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. Eh? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I think Krillin's right. You guys are the worst. My name's Son Goku and I'm from Earth. Take your lies and get out of here. <laughs> well, I couldn't even if I wanted to. Because Planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Ugh. Including me and you, there are only four Saiyans left. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you, Kakarot. The planet is as good as ours if you join us. Come on, Kakarot! Think of the fun we'll have! Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? Just shut up! If you think I'm joining you, then you're dumber than you look! Huh. Fine. Be that way. That little runt with the tail behind you is your kid, right? I guess I'll just take him instead. Huh? Come any closer and I'll knock you sky high! Back off! <laughs> oh yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere with you! Uh, All right, Goku time. What the hell's with this guy? What's wrong? You scared? Ah! 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 Can't you try that? You're not my father. You're nothing to me. Go on, get out of here. Kakarot, don't turn your back on your family, your people! Try this! Here goes! What the hell? Cut it to your tail! I had it cut off a long time ago! Fool! Why would you do that? Do you know what? This planet isn't half bad. I think it could serve as our next target. The three of us Saiyans should be able to rid this place of its death weight just one month. Yeah, what's going on? Um, your kid's in real trouble if this is the best you can do. I don't know why he's saying that when I just what? beat his ass. Alright, well, let's get to the final fight with you, Radish. Sure to take good care of the boy. If you want him back, then you better do as your big brother said. Give him back. Don't even think about trying to be a hero. <laughs> no, no. Bulma. You still got that dragon radar? Oh, I get it! That decoration on Gohan's hat was a dragon ball! All right, I'm off! It's now or never! You're as good as dead on your own! Piccolo! Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. At least if we tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle in all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. 
That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture, I'd finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. Guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely. Yeah, that was the most part of the story. All right, well, we're going to have to continue on. Let's continue on to actually getting Gohan back. Where are we flying to, boy? All right. Time to go. Hey. Wait, Goku, take this with you. We got Vita huh? drink. What's this? It's a quick acting recovery drink. If you're ever in a pinch, take a swig of that. Try sending recovery item to the item palette. All right. Cannot be used. Register. It's on triangle now. Thank you. <sighs> hey. Better not die on me. Yeah. Enough. Let's go. Right. Flying Nimbus. Even though we were just flying in the fight. When does he learn to fly? I forget when he learns to actually fly on his own. The great DBZA quote. Are you a Yoshi? Hold tight, Gohan. We're coming. All right, next story. Earth's dream team to the rescue. After progressing to a certain point in the main story, you will begin to travel and fight alongside other characters. These support characters can assist you in a variety of ways in battle, so don't forget them when they're in the help. Uh, you can use support characters. All right, so I saw that before. We have to just try it out when we get there. That's pretty much it. All right, let's do it. Oh, we're still saving. Okay, all right. Let's get a move on. Just a little longer. Goku, get a move on. Quit messing around. You really don't recall anything about the Saiyans that Raditz clown was going on about? No, none of it rings a bell. It's crazy. I had no idea I had an older brother either. <laughs> I was hoping to milk some useful information out of you for our fight. Are you a Yoshi? Oh, we have to go to the world map, so we gotta get out of this anyway. World map. How... where do I go? How do we get out of here? I'll go to world map. Alright, select the icon on the world map. Alright, so we gotta go to the red pillar. We're going to Luka Village. Why can't I go? Oh, there we go. You have to actually click on the bubble. Going off for Raditz now. They're doing the story recap. So Raditz took Gohan, and we're going to go beat him up. Maybe he shouldn't have taken our son. That fool. Come on, game. Get a load. We're almost there. All right, here we go. Hey, there's a steel bridge. His tail's probably his weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. How are we supposed to grab his tail? Yeah! How ah! do you activate it? You can outride Tao Pai Pai's thing. That's pretty cool. Look, the windmill spinning. I can barely turn with this thing. We're closing in on him. Let's head down and move in for the attack. No. He's using a device that tells him our strengths as well as our location. Eating food dishes can permanently increase your stat boost. Da, 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 da. Oh, so 
This is what we want to eat now. All right, we're using the boiled fish. Eat the meal. Perfect. Huh? What's this? A power level of 710. Where the hell? Kakarot's kid? No way! Damn, this thing must be busted! What? Another reading? And it's heading straight for me! There's one? No, there's two. With power levels 322 and 334. They've come. So, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to get my son back! Where is he? You're hiding him somewhere, aren't you? His screaming was giving me a headache, so I locked him up in there. But forget about the rot. Don't tell me you actually think you stand a chance against me. You fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! Alright, let's do you know, it. Believe it or not, battles aren't just about strength. I'm using the wrong team. Man, he's fast. Get away! Disoriented! Finesse! Not rats. Yeah, yeah. Oh, one Then you can just forget about joining us. You're nothing but a distraction. Rock, paper, scissors! Disorder! Ah! No way! Keep using Kamehameha by accident. It's only a matter of time before you're both dead. I think I'll start putting a little more oomph uh, into my uh -oh. attacks. Got to let it fly sometimes. This game is oh, that's it. now. All right, cool. Almost got obliterated. Let's see what happens. Ooh, some levels, nice. <laughs> Even with your combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. You gotta be kidding me! You know what? Since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. But... If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku! <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. <laughs> Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death. I'm just gonna need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. <sighs> gonna need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. 
Supreme Cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. You nah, time alone. to hold them down. What were you two trying to decide who gets to die first? We ain't planning on losing. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. No way! Oh, that broke me. Uh-oh. Oh, baby. It's a little easier for Dexter to get them. Do. 
Come on, this needs to be the finisher. That was it right there. Oh, good. Jesus, I was getting, we were getting obliterated on that one. God, oh man. His power level, it's 1330. He's focusing all of his power into his fingertips. Damn it! He's got that much control over his energy! You let your guard down! Now I've got your tail! Damn it! When did you? Good work, Goku! Hold on to that tail and don't let go no matter what! Wait! Let me go! I'll leave this planet in peace! Don't listen to him, Goku! He's trying to trick you! Please, please, believe me, brother! I'm begging you, Kakarot! Don't do this to your only family! I can't believe you fell for it! You might actually be the dumbest guy I've ever met! Don't think I'm going to show you mercy just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes, that's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! He's dead. So is Goku. That's game. Kakarot's dead. Impossible. I I can't be beaten by scum like this. I can't. <sighs> well, you just were. <laughs> I, I, I can't believe that Kakarot would just throw away his own life. You idiot. Trust me, Goku won't be dead for very long. What? Didn't you know? This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. <laughs> Everything you just said was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, I will come here. How long until then? When? When will they? When do you think they'll get here? A year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two. 
have no hope of beating them. Enjoy what little time you have left. <laughs> I... I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku! Hang in there! It's not like you to give up so easily! <laughs> Trillin, you know... Dying... It's a lot worse than I thought it would be. <laughs> uh, yeah, but... Don't you worry! We're gonna bring you back really soon! <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Goku! What the? He's gone! Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Eh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. What? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, Tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him. Ah, oh, there we go. Got some XP, got some levels. Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz. The bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth, for immortality. Can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. Alrighty. We're nearing the end of the Raditz part of this. Uh, we will cut it once the cutscenes are officially over. But so far, I'm really liking the game. I know it's been a year out, but you know what? I still like Dragon Ball, so I'll play it. All right, we're still watching some cutscenes. And that is why I brought him here as he is, to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000-mile-long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. 
By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana, mana what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, um, actually kind of in a hurry. Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's a very easy question. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right. Next question. Who is more powerful, King Yama or Kami? Oh, King Yama. Correct. Of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. Uh, who is judged here after death? That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an Earthling. Next question. My god, how many questions? Uh, is there a way to bring those who have already died? Oh, uh, what? Sorry, but that's incorrect. Oh, uh, the dragon Think ball. hard before you answer next time. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? Care to shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, King Yama, I... <sighs> Whatever. Moving on. Which question is this? So we asked about where Raditz was. We were asked about who goes there, who's stronger. This is the fifth. What? Sorry, but that's incorrect. What are you talking about? Wait, huh? all right. What? This is the fifth question, right? Yeah. Really? Um, one, two, three. Hmm. Of course it was, I... I was just testing you. Damn it, you. King Yama. And you passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Mm, I heard that, Kami. Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> Oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. Hmm. That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. 
All right, cool. Some medals. All righty. So I think we're nearing our end here. I just want to make sure there's no more cutscenes. But I hope you enjoy this episode of part two of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. We will continue to run through it and do play through the Dragon Ball Z story. I think it will be a fun time for all around here. I'm enjoying the game so far. And it's fun to relive the old moments from Z that you don't really uh, care about too much anymore. So let's just make sure there's no more cutscenes. Time to wake up, kid. You've slept long enough. Huh? Who, who are you? Listen up. Time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you, in case you forgot. His friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls. They can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Alrighty. Gohan's crash course so I guess the next survival. part we'll do when we come back is Gohan's survival with Piccolo. But... I... I... I I'm no... I'm no good at fighting! Quit your whining! Once I'm done whipping you into shape, you'll be tough enough for anything. Got it? So, you, you're gonna train me? Okay, what do I have to do? You have to live out here on your own, without distraction. I'm giving you six months. If you're able to survive for that long, I'll teach you how to fight. See ya. Whoop, everything. <gasps> Alright, this is where we will pick up next episode. I hope everyone enjoyed.